Good morning and welcome back. And how are we? A little bit of a later start than I uh, was hoping for, but we ended up. Might as well show you. Hey, Dave. Hello. Ended up getting this, uh, this bender, which we had to put together. So we had to sort that out, get a bit of a move about. The press is now here. The wash thing is over by there. We had a nice little move about. And also, my van's not here. Yeah. She moved in. Outside in the rain. Look at that. She is outside in the wild. When I came in this morning, we come down from up there and I was just like, what is, I need to get that in. And then we can start cracking on with the day. So I'm going to get that in. We'll go see John, see what he's up to. Look at that. She drove in. Still finding it quite weird being able to drive this thing in. I mean, the back bumper's not even on. Also, <laughs> my bumper's on the roof. And definitely need to sort something out with the road. Oh, and also, I don't know how well the camera's gonna pick that up. Yeah, my seat's kind of not bolted in at all. But she drove it in. It still feels super weird being able to drive this thing. But as you can obviously see, this was outside and that van is there. And the van that I was gonna take to the NC500 is there, which is why that's there. Which we're gonna talk about in a bit because NC500 is what, eight weeks away? And we're no closer to it yet. But we'll get into that in a bit. But, hello Mr. John. How are we? Right, thank you. You got that. Don't you get that? Four jokes. Um, okay. And anyone's clock thing pulls and bars. You need to go drop the whole something down. And the fuel tank. And the fuel tank. So put some pink torsions. What's actually on here, do we know? Not pink. But you probably remember this van. This is the van that Di had and was doing all the welding on. It's the one that Di started before he had his pneumonia and he managed to sort of do bits and bits and bobs. Look at that. She's done all the way around. She's now over on John's side for the mechanicals. Di was meant to take that van to the NC500 and now Di's not taking that one. He's now got this one. So Di needs to get a few bits of welding done on that, but that one's a little bit more rotten than expected. Are you taking the pop off of it? Yeah. No, you were taking the pop top off of it. I am doing nothing of the sort. So that pop top there, that needs to come off and go on to there. And then all the stuff that Dai's got for that van then needs to be transplanted from there and put into there. But before that, Dai's got some welding to do. As you can already see, he has already started. He's already made a start on doing this lot. And then this one, it's gonna be Dai's new NC500. Only eight weeks to go, boy. Eight weeks, yeah. You haven't got much, <laughs> you haven't got much to do. Nah, nah, nah. I need a little bit. Oh, nom, 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 nom. Yeah. Well, believe it or not, she's still better than um, another one. Is the other one actually that bad? Oh, boy. No brigas, all this bits gone. Is it actually like that bad? Oh, yeah. Real tabs. To be fair, the back of this looks right, doesn't it? There's a tab going on this side. You can't see it now, but there's know. a little bit on that bit down there. Yeah. But uh, on the floor, on the same way. That, that tab will uh, go up and go up. But... You can see there's a bit down there. It's still better than that. Now. This side, like that side is nothing. This side will take me longer. But... What are you going to do? Patch that or put a new step on? Um. I'm gonna clean the steps out, obviously cut the lip and then hopefully patch or two and we'll do like <coughs> and obviously it's a bit um 
Nom, 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 nom. Yeah. And we only have eight weeks to go. We have to get that done. That done. And also, John's bound. Which he's not taking that one anymore. That's not going. The engine for it is there. Yeah, that one's not going. We've got other plans for that. But, that's that. As you can see, things are in. Things are getting done. Happy, happy, happy. So, we're going to get a bit more bits and bobs done, did. And in a bit, I'll pick a camera up and I'll show you what I'm actually doing. Why is there that on my van? I don't know. Right, when there's something to show, I'll uh, pick a camera up a bit, but... See you boat. And we're back. Me and John had to go run some errands. But John is just going to finish off doing all of this. Get it all built back up again. That needs to be replaced. We went through all this earlier. So John's going to carry on doing that. I am going to get underneath this bad mama jammer and die smoking out the workshop. Mr. Die is welding his step. Wow. So they working on the rest of the van? Because it's so busy. He's doing his NC. The NC mobile. Yeah. No, at least this side's mm. nearly mostly done. Not much. Let's get in there, buddy. Yeah, man. So I'll leave Mr. Dye to do that. And I need to get underneath here. Right, so, for anyone that is interested, that is how low I set. So the camera is about level with the floor. I do want to go across all of this lot, do a nice little bolt check, make sure everything is actually tight. Because when John moved it, he did say there was a weird clunk. So it might just be something's not quite tight. Now I do actually know that my shocks aren't actually in and the drop links are just floating. So that might not help. But go around, do a full bolt check. Right. I'm gonna go under there, get a bolt check done, make sure everything's all nice and tight. And speak to Dave very nicely and see if he can weld up the uh, shock mount plate things, because they're not actually in, you can't see any of that. So I'm just gonna do a quick bolt check and I'll pick you guys up in a minute, so. Right, I'm gonna do this. I'll pick a camera up in a minute, so see you in a moment. Well, managed to do up all the bolts I can find. That was loose. That was loose. I remember when we put them in, we said we just finger tight them. I've got to do up that bolt. I'm pretty sure it's not tight. And the one, the other end of the subframe, which is just up there. Checked all the ball joints, checked the subframe. The only one that I can feel is a little bit loose is that one up there. I don't know what that one's like up there. Oh, mostly tight. Let's tighten that up a bit more. But, oh. Right, I'm gonna go tighten up those couple of bolts and then this is pretty much all done. Check the gearbox. Yeah, so I'm gonna get up there, try and get those bolts a little bit tighter. And I'll pick this up once they're tight. So see them up. There we go. A few bits and bobs happened, including getting dirty. But, managed to get all the bolts nice and tight, how they should be. I do remember when we were putting all together, we just hand tight everything. And then didn't do anything else about that. Also, my exhaust tips on, yes. Short wheelbase and a long wheelbase van, and it looks cool. But, that's all that diddly done. Mr. Dynamo, you ain't gonna see it. Oh, I might go to show you. Finished welding these. I've just painted them, waiting for all to dry next to the fire. And, Mr. Dynamo has done all of this. 
diddly done. Also, there was a hole in there. So he's done that. He's now. Oh, that bit. Cut it out. Make a new patch for there. Make a little bit for in there as well. And then this side is completed. So at least, peace of mind, that's done. And then he's just got a Do all of this, and apparently he needs to do a rear arch on this one because this one isn't any good. No, oh. that's well, not too bad. I expected it to be worse. And Mr. Jono, fuel tank out. Torsion bars out. Did have whatever colour these were. Green. Green. There you go. It had green. It's now having clocked pink. So that is that. Clocked pink torsion bars. And then this bad girl will be going for an MOT. There we go. There's a little update done. Once the uh, paint's dry and I've done the other coat on the other side, I'll pick a camera up and show you the next bit. So see you in a moment. Well, there we go. A few more bits done. I have completely finished painting them. Just waiting for them to uh, dry next to the fire. And time to put this water bottle on. I did have this pump, but I don't know where it's come from. But it's not the right one. It doesn't fit. So, well, that one does. So, need to get that all plumbed in. Right, that's sort of, you ain't going to see any of that, well that's kind of tidy enough. Well, there's an absolute pain in the ass to try and get that lot to fit, but she's in, she's plumbed in, even got the intake put on properly. So we're looking quite gravy. And, so, working. Happy, happy, happy. Do need to put that back before it goes missing and then I get shot with that. So that, there's not a massive amount under the bonnet that he's doing. I've got that bracket. So that can be dealt with in a bit. I will sort of bracket out for the intake at some point, but for now that's good enough. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Everything's going well. Everything is going swimmingly. Also, I found a little bit more uh, rust than he was expecting, which isn't quite what he had in hopes. I need to wait for the paint to, sorry, paint to dry, because then my shot can go on. Still a little tiny bit tacky. So, leave them, I'll put them in tomorrow. Yeah, do need to have a little chop of the wee latch, because she's a little bit pulled out by that. So. Right, I have a plan. Let me go wash my hands. And then I'll put my plan in action. Cinema. There is one thing I want to do before I leave. Just one. Just one thing I want to do. Place the dash in. Place the dash in. Mate, why not move that knife from here? Huh? There's a steely meal knife.
Look at that. She sort of has a dash in. It's mad how much it just looks more like a vehicle. Well, that's kind of why I wanted to put it in. I mean, nothing's actually bolted in, and I definitely need to sort out all the vents up underneath. But. Yeah, see, that vent's got to go on the top first. Yeah. Yeah, I just kind of wanted to put it in and just sort of be happy about something. Yeah. It's actually a full bag. Is that the brake? Yeah. 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 Everything works. NC500 next week. Tomorrow, get them shocks in. Cut that arch. I say I'm going to cut the arch. <laughs> oh, my this. She's looking so complete. Should really put a bumper on, but... Happy, happy, happy. You happy? All right, we're going to get ourselves gone. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed. If you have, please give us a thumbs up. But, as always, thank you for watching. Thank you for putting up with our... Dumbass. And as always, take it easy.